is Jilla and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be doing a makeup video and before you guys are like nah um I just want to incorporate some different videos every now and then on my channel just because you know it's my channel so yeah plus I have been getting a lot of comments on my videos about my makeup and people have been saying they really love my makeup and like um you know what lipstick are you wearing or blah 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 so I just thought get ready with me we'll do that you guys have been asking about my beauty videos and most of them are on private because like no but some of them are still up so i just thought let's just make a new one for anyone that wants to see it and i thought i'm getting ready anyways let's just film it i'm doing a different look today that i don't really do which i'm like gonna mix like highlighter with my uh foundation so let's jump right into it guys this will be a long ride don't hate me i just because like i don't know what i'm doing but it's okay i should mention by the way everything in this video in this look is cruelty free um i only buy products that are cruelty free and i know some products um you know there's controversy around if certain things are cruelty free or whatever do your own research look up your own stuff but from my knowledge these brands are all cruelty free yeah but today i'm going to be taking the Too faced born this way um foundation which this one's great if you're looking for a foundation this one um it is expensive because it is um high-end makeup so you do you but i like this one and then we're gonna do something risky today and i want to go for a dewy look today which i don't do i i mean i sh like paint on highlighter but i don't put it in my foundation so i have this cover fx enhancer drops in the color cs gel i think is how you say it and there are these drops these i got for christmas because they're super expensive and i'm not going to buy them myself but you can get cheaper ones there's a brand called like iconic london or some shit i don't know if they're cruelty free or what their deal is but they have similar drops so you just i'm just gonna drop it onto my hand with the foundation Again, don't know what I'm doing. Let's hope this turns out. Yay. I'm going to be getting a back of a brush that I don't use because I don't know what else to use at the moment. Ooh, 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 beautiful. Okay, I dig it. Okay. So I'm going to be... I a makeup video in a while, so like, I'm like, where where do I put the, the mirror? Where do I look? Where do I... <laughs> where do I fucking... How do I do this? Is this even enough? This is probably too much. What am I saying? This is a fucking lot of foundation. This does not look like it matches me, but it does, I promise. Where's my knockoff Artiste brush? Boy. Oh, here it is. So I'm going to be taking this Eye Beauty brush, and it's like one of these big fucking circle ones. <laughs> and it's it's like a dupe for like the Artiste brush, the one that's like like a hundred bucks. So no thanks. And this one I know is cruelty free. I don't know about the other ones, but yeah. So blend, blend. Make sure I don't have streaks from the brush. I'm gonna be going in with a beauty blender, which I finally invested in after like what four four years I'm doing makeup. I'm gonna get the Kevon D Locket concealer, which I'm obsessed with. Uh, I talked about it in some favorites videos recently. I love it. Um, <laughs> Funny story, my mom saw me putting on my makeup and she was like, how much concealer do you put on? And I'm like, a lot? Chin and on the nose and up here. And that, guys, is my video. I'll see you next week. I almost forgot about my nose. I probably would have left it, honestly. I would have been like, what happened? <laughs> what did I do? Nothing. <laughs> okay, so my base so far is laid down. Um, now I'm just going to be taking some powder. I have the Tarte um, Translucent Smooth Operator Powder. Um, I like this one. It goes everywhere. Um, I've been doing baking, which, girl, I don't, I don't bake my face. But I mean, I've been trying it and I like it. This is being said. For the record, I usually don't put this much on, but 
special occasion. Am I right? No. Okay. Well, I let that sit. I do other things. So I'm gonna do my brows, which is my favorite thing, um, sort of. First, I fill in the bottom. I outline it, like the bottom of my eyebrow. Then I outline the top. Then I fill it in, and then I make sure like the part at the front isn't like fucking up square. So yes. One brow sort of done. Uh, my eyebrows both have different shapes, don't know why. This is how I tend to do my brows and then I'm just gonna be grabbing the NYX Tinted Brow Mascara. This one is in brunette and I'm just going to be, you know, uh, sticking them down. I'm going to do a tiny bit of eyeshadow. Um, I'm not going to be using brushes in this video for my eyeshadow. Well, like, because my brushes are dirty and they have, like, my black smoky stuff on them. So I'm not even going to try to use them for a light color. But I'm not doing, like, anything, really. I'm just going to be taking, well, the slip thingies out. But this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, the, like, original one. I know there's, like, a semi-sweet one. But I'm going to be taking this shade. It's, like, a really, like, light sparkly shade. I believe it's called, like, Champagne something. I don't know. I don't even remember, but I'm just gonna be taking that with my finger because we're here. I'm bring it into my inner corner as well to just, you know, pop the whole thing, you know? And then I'm gonna be taking this light brown that's right over here. And I'm going to be just putting a bit of that into my crease. And now I'm just going to be taking this darker brown on the same blending brush because, yes. And I'm just gonna be putting some of that into the crease there. Taking this really tiny little brush, going in with that same dark brown and putting it right under my lower lash line. Quickly went in and blended the eyeshadow a bit more, but this is what, I have here today. Um, I am also now going to be doing some eyeliner. I'm going to be attempting a thin line. This is the NYX Vinyl Liquid Liner. Perfect, so I have the eyeliner done and I don't think I'm going to be doing any false lashes today just because I want to keep it natural, dewy. This is not natural, but I want to keep it kind of dewy and mostly focus on the glow and all that shit. So I'm going to be instead just putting on some mascara. This is the Physician's Formula Mascara. Um, what is it called? Sexy Booster Cat Eye Collection. It's super pretty. Super pretty. But I'm going to be using this. It has a a massive wand. Um, it's all right. I just use it. It's fine. I'm going to apply a second coat and I the second coat is on. Now I'm just going to be taking a black pencil liner from NYX. This is in the color black bean. And I'm just going to be lining my water line. I just did some pencil liner. I did skip over that section because I went really close to the mirror and was trying not to stab my eye out. So, and I need to put my beauty blender to like put my skin down while I do it, you know? Now it's back to face makeup again. So I'm going to be taking my, this big brush that I love. It's actually a bronzer brush from Sephora. It's super soft and I use it to just wipe off. I use this to blend actually all the time, but I also use it to wipe off powder. The powder is all wiped off. Uh, it looks, honestly, it looks so much better looking at it without the powder. Because when I'd watch people's videos and they'd have all this powder, I was like, 
Huh? He looks really strange, but anyways, looks better now that it's all off. But uh, next I'm going to be going in with a bit of bronzer. Um, this is one of my favorite palettes is the NYX um, Highlight and Contour Palette. As you can see, there's a lot of NYX in this video. Um, I really love their brand and it's cruelty free. I love their quality, so I use it a lot. And I use the I use this shade in the contour kit, which is uh, is toffee. Huh? Never really looked at the shade name. No, that's not toffee. Oh seven. Oh seven is sculpt. Perfect. Perfect. I was gonna say I'm like that does not look like toffee. Okay. I'm just going to be taking that big brush again and trying to blend this out. I'm going to be taking again the highlight and contour kit and I'm going to be going into the shade, this shade, which is soft light. And I just pat a bit of this. It doesn't have any shimmer to it. A little bit, not really. Um, and it's, I use it mostly to go over areas and like make sure they're all blended. There we have it for the contour and bronzer and all that. Um, next, I think I'm going to be applying a little bit of blush. Uh, blush I never even used to wear because my cheeks were always very rosy. But um, why am I tapping it? It's cream. Anyways, I usually don't like blush. I usually like looking pale with just a little bit of glow. But... I think today I'm just going to be applying a bit. Done. Now we're going to get to my favorite part of the whole look, which is highlighter. I'm going to be taking the Jeffree Star and Mini MUA collab in Eclipse. So now I'm going to be taking this highlighter by Jeffree Star and Mini MUA. It's in the color Eclipse. I'm going to be taking my NYX um, fan brush and just go into town and highlighting. And I like to bring it up a little bit as well. And I'm going to be putting some on my Cupid's bow. And then I'm going to be getting my smaller brush. So then I'm going to be going in with a smaller brush, just with my real techniques. And I'm just going to be also highlighting the tip of my nose. And patting that in. Um, down a bit down my nose which i never do the the bridge of my nose or my nose i don't know i just don't but we'll do it today um i also highlight underneath my brow bone which i love to do and i also highlight my inner corner again now just going to be doing the last step and applying lipstick which is the one i wear all the time. It's um, the Jeffree Star M M Manny MUA collab. This is in the shade Daddy. It's a liquid lipstick. And just applying that to my lips. thank you guys so much for watching um this was kind of a different look for me i tend to do a lot of highlight um but i did take a little, a little like some little risks in this video so i really hope you guys enjoyed it um it's not gonna be like a regular regular thing but i just thought i get a lot of questions and a lot of compliments about my makeup so i thought i'd just do a video showing you guys how i sort of do it so yeah oh i forgot to mention i love to highlight my collarbones like especially when i'm wearing shirts like these that are a bit lower in cut um i like to you gotta like puff out your collarbones and highlight them. Oh, look at that. Yeah. I've got a